Hi guys, it's Mike at youarethepath.com. So you may be asking yourself, you know, what's this all about? Well, I wanted to create a YouTube channel where people can come and get inspired and maybe get some cool information at the same time. Sometimes when you're watching a video, it only takes someone to say just one small thing that makes you think, ah, I never thought of it that way and just can create a lot of space and peace for you. So I may be making a five, ten minute video and I might just say like one thing on something that can change that person's life. So that's my intention behind the videos. Some of the things that have influenced me have been uh, God Conversations, the documentary, the movie documentary, The Secret, Law of Attraction, What the Bleep, Eckhart Tolle, The Power of Now, I'm interested in EFT, I meditate, and I do a lot of yoga and Tai Chi. So it's going to be very much about keeping yourself in the now. So it's the application of all of these things and how you can apply these teachings into your daily life. Now, I actually made this video yesterday, but I was editing it and it's like I'm saying a load of things together. So what you're going to see now is um, just a few things of what you can expect. So I'm probably going to be covering relationships, facing your fears, uncovering where you hold yourself back health, how to improve your health, addictions, how to let go of addictions, you know, topics like this. So I hope you get something out of it and I'll see you guys in the next video. As within, so without. You know, when you change the way you think, you start watching your thoughts, not letting your thoughts be the master over you, but you start being the detached witness of your own thoughts. You're going to create a lot of space for yourself, self-acceptance, acceptance of other people and you still may judge other people but you notice that you're judging them and you don't judge yourself for holding the judgment. If you've watched the movie documentary The Secret or What the Bleep, you'll know already that we create our own reality. It's consciousness and energy that creates reality. It's not just the philosophy of it. You've got to take action. So I'm going to be doing a lot of yoga, Tai Chi. You know, I love the way yoga makes me feel. I love the way Tai Chi makes me feel. I feel lighter. So... The weekly videos are hopefully going to keep you inspired into taking action and it's usually fear and laziness that holds us back. If laziness is one of the things that may be holding you back, you can check out my 40 day challenge I did on YouTube and I challenged myself to wake up at 5am every morning um, for 40 days and I was doing candle focus. And I had what I believe to be my first Kundalini experience. You know, I felt the energy. Now my goal is to raise the energy. Now, some of you may struggle to distinguish between religion and spirituality. You may hear me talk about God quite a lot. I don't mean God in a religious sense. You know, in a sense of a God up there looking down on us, getting pissed off at us, as if God's got emotional problems and he's going to want to burn us in hell and stuff like that. Um, I don't mean God in that way. I may even talk about Jesus and even, well, 
I may even talk about Yeshua Ben Joseph I don't mean in a religious sense you know I believe in the second coming you know the second coming of Christ but it's going to be within us you know Christ consciousness returning to the earth within us so you know I know that I may have lost a few of you already just by saying that but you know this is gonna be about me being who I am there's no right or wrong as such I'm not trying to make anyone wrong um, you know I didn't used to believe in Yeshua bin Joseph I didn't really you know I didn't know what I believed my life was just about survival for me a long time ago so I'm training to be a life coach and um, I need to get 50 hours practice so I can take on I can probably take on about four clients so that's going to be free coaching so I'll be able to support you through the changes that you want to make and it's non-judgmental you know this is about unconditional love if you've been feeling down and you found this video and it's making you feel enthusiastic about getting going about making some changes do it run with it you know a lot of the times we get a boost of energy and we just sit on it and we think yeah that would be a great idea you know I could do this I could do that we end up sitting on it and then we make excuses I haven't got this yet that's not sorted yet that needs to be done before I can do that maybe um, you've broken up with your girlfriend or you've broken up with your boyfriend or whatever's happened you're feeling down um, you're a bit low on self-esteem maybe the greatest thing you can do is change create changes however small it may be for me a few years back giving up weed was um, a big change there were still there were a lot of other things about my life that I wanted to change so I mean smoking weed was just one thing you know you only have to pick just one thing and once you've conquered that you've always got that to fall back on you know the rest of your life may still be a mess but that one thing that you've um, stayed true to you can always fall back on that and you take it a step at a time I'm on a journey of evolution you know I'm evolving myself there's a lot of addictions and behaviors that I've let go of and there are still more there's still more about myself that I want to change there's more about myself the self that I want to uncover and I want to create the unknowns I want to go beyond my fears and that's what I'm going to be setting out to do